in there. Okay, now we're going to select the same pattern because we, the only thing we changed is we picked a different baseline. So add a pattern, go to geometric, go to four leaf clover, and select it. There! See, it's in the box only sideways because we started on a different corner, so our baseline was in a different area. That's how Shirley thinks. So we have to kind of conform to the way she's thinking to get the right result. Now I'm going to bring up my edit menu because I need to scale that to fit that box before I stitch it out. Scale. And like I said, I can use the slider bars or a smart scale. I always use a smart scale. Keep your pattern proportions, yes. And now she's thinking because the little light bulb is up there. Snap right into the box. I'm going to stitch that out for you too. The green is already on the needle and thread and the button says we're ready to go. So all I have to do is touch it. The machine will move to the start of the pattern block, and the pattern will start. Okay. The prompt says, after the machine arrives at the start position, pull up the bobbin thread and press OK. I'm just going to touch the needle up. I'm going to grab my tail, and that needle will cycle once. I move that back from where I stitched. Pull everything up you can get up. I don't want any bird's nests on the back. 